Hey everybody, Tia here at B5 Designs. Welcome to my channel and I am on to share an incoming swap that I received from Kimberly Sanderson and I, this is a Facebook group and I'm trying to think if it's, I don't remember the name of the Facebook group. I have two Facebook, three Facebook groups that I swap on currently, um, but I will put it in the description box when I go to post this, but look at this sweet little card she made to go with this. I hope that my, I'm not getting the warning to clean my camera lens, so hopefully this is coming out clear. Let me raise that up. I wish I was better at videoing. I'm, I think I'm getting better now that I'm back in my craft room. But this is like a, almost like a library pocket. And I don't know. It's so cute. It's really cute. Um, it has the, I don't know if she made this or, well, obviously she made it. But, you know, if it is completely homemade or if it was in a kid or you know what I'm trying to say but what I think is so cool is this opening here and that's that's why I kind of wondered if it was like a, a kit of some kind that she got and then she has the um, it has like a little lace doily it's already printed on the paper and then she added some twine and then her little card says I just want to make sure there is no um, addresses on here. Anyway, so she put these stickers on this little card and uh, bonjour. And it's the flower. Oh, here we go. The flower bouquet swap at the paper shack swap group. Okay, I couldn't remember if it was that one or the crafters swapping lounge. And again, this is from Kimberly Sanderson, and she says, I hope you like what I made for you. Please check out my new you, new, geez, new YouTube channel at Crafts with Kim. So there is her YouTube channel right there, you guys. I will try to remember to link this stuff below. This is so cute, so cute. And for the big reveal, here is the flower bouquet. These are so stunning. I have to make mine still uh, because I'm a little bit behind, but I've been in contact with her. So I actually lost it, if that makes sense. It kind of, when I went to look at the events and see what I signed up for, it kind of disappeared on me. So, um, I honestly, I kind of forgot about it. And then I got this and I was like, oh no. So this is vellum. And if you go over and you watch, um, now I watched, um, your crafty BFF she does a tutorial on these but this one's a little bit different than hers because Kimberly has a very rounded I don't think um Bethany's was rounded but you know that's that's all open to interpretation and how you want to create but this is vellum obviously and vellum can be touchy to glue but she did an amazing job and she has this very cute um, ribbon around it and we've got these embossed butterflies so pretty in different colors and then the yellow and white it's heavier than Baker's twine it's it's a pretty heavy twine and then she has the different flowers kind of like sunflowers and these almost I almost thought this was a wax seal that's how wonderfully embossed this came out um anyway so she's got obviously 
<laughs> we've got purple flowers, uh, purple petals, and then we have the gingham centers. We have yellow with yellow and white flowers and the yellow centers. And she just did a fabulous mix. And then she took, I'm assuming it's glossy accents. And she just put like, like dew drops basically. Maybe that's what it is, is dew drops on there. And then she also has the leaves in there. So very pretty. I love it. I really, I love the colors. I'm partial to, I love all colors, but I really, my purple was my mom's favorite color. So I love that. And I love yellow. And it's funny because I've always loved yellow. Uh, my favorite color is green, but I've always loved yellow. And my mom would always say, don't wear yellow. You don't look good in yellow, but it's one of my favorite colors. I don't wear it a lot, but I did when I was younger because I was thinner. Now I'm not so thin, so I don't wear it. <laughs> um, I'm very funny about what colors I will wear. Uh, just, I don't know. That's just the way I am. Anyhow, this is just so beautiful. I love it. This is one of those things that will go on my bulletin boards that set in front of my craft station, my desk that I actually do my crafts at, um, so that I can look at it all the time. It is just gorgeous. And someday, when I feel like my craft room isn't a disaster, I will do a video and show you what it looks like. But thank you so much, Kimberly. This is so cute. I love it. And thank you for being my swap partner. And I will see you guys in my next crafty video. Bye.